All right, there we go. There we go. What you got? What you got? This is something I just started on. I'm working on. I'm still still working on it or whatever, man. But uh, little joint. Oh shit. <laughs> Just, you know, hey some, man, something I'm cooking up. You know what I'm saying? When it get finished, it's gonna be an epic event. Hey man, that drum right there was crazy off the rip. I appreciate man. it, man. <laughs> God dang. Now, hey, for I, now, I think they see why we're here real fast. Oh man, if if they can only have a, a, a portion of what we've already heard, which is why we're here. And I mean, that was a smidget, but I'm right. sure. Can, 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 is, uh, there, is there another one? Yeah, another this, one. This is another 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 startup joint I just started on. I ain't, I ain't finished yet, but cause see this I'm how excited about it. see see this how God works. You understand? You say you know so you need to have the outlet to where folks can get access to you and hear what you create and the greatness that you are able to construct. So then Scorpio come in here, shove a camera in your face. You play a couple of beats, it ends up on YouTube. Now all of a sudden it's five million hits because folks trying to get these beats that they heard that they ain't even know was existing right here off of old net. You know what I'm saying? Right, right, oh, yeah, right. I forgot to even mention we on Old National right now. Yeah, in I mean, South we in the hood, Island. you know what I'm saying? We, we in the hood, Atlanta, the heart of Atlanta, Old National. This is where I first came to visit when I, you know, me coming with, down here uh, to visit Chris Daddy in 92. When I first came to Atlanta, we stayed right off Creole Road, you know what I'm saying? Spicewood Lane, down there over there, right around the corner from where we at right now. And it's funny how things are circular. You come back to the beginning, you understand? The origin on which you started. You understand what I'm saying? All right, true philosopher. Hey man, if I I can't educate the people, what I'm even talking to these MNFs for? Look (laughs) at your child is right there. You get you get a cameo? Hey bro. No cameo. No. (laughs) He's like, no, I'm not with that. (laughs) He's like, no, I'm not with that, brother. Uh, This is another joint. I just started on. I ain't done yet. I'm still, I'm still building it or whatnot. Cut that off, cut that off, man. Cut that off, cut that off. They getting too much, man. Hey, stop it. No, don't play nothing else, dog. Don't play nothing else. Stop it. We are cutting off. They gotta pay to hear anything else, man. That's it. That's too much. That was too much, man. Hey. Back to the money. That was too much, man. They gotta pay to see hear anything more from T L T Mo, man. That's a wrap. Don't play nothing else, man. Don't play. No, don't. Don't play it, bro. Don't play it. We gotta get it back, man. We gotta we gotta get this thing back, man. They didn't let it go. They let it go too far, man. This that's, is, that's what I said. We, we got to get it back to when, we got to get it back to how Puffy and them came up. How even is what, what Eminem and Fifty Cent, Nelly, mm-hmm. yeah. they like some of the last of the Mohican to really <laughs> right. get it, get it. You know what I'm saying? Like life changing, like real life changing. Uh, Baby and them, mm-hmm. yeah. you know what I'm saying Cash Money. You know what I'm saying? They some of the last of the Mohican that's still out here, like that really benefited from this from this line of work. As opposed to cats out here now, nah, y'all really ain't benefiting like y'all could, man. Y'all need to do y'all research, uh, research your history, man, and see how this thing could really be benefited from. I personally opt to shut the internet down. That'd be like the reset button, you know what I'm <laughs> straight up. It'll force wow. it'll force the consumer to get back accustomed to paying for the music. And that's funny because even with the release of my new 
mixtape attack of the sea monkeys i really haven't gone viral with it i've been more or less in the streets just really people to people with it to where it's more of a personal relation because everybody in atlanta raps so then it's like to really go on the campaign it's like you campaigning with seven thousand folks with the internet so when you can make it more personal then it's back to the real world where the internet the matrix is cut off you got to actually look a person and talk to them it ain't just yeah. <clears throat> right. Yeah. The internet. You're right. I, I hate to say it, man. When you talk about going back to where it used to be, you're right. Shutting the internet down would be. That's how Puffy. One. That's how Puffy, Nelly, yeah, Fifty, yeah. Baby Wayne, Eminem, all. That's all of those cats. You know, so I'm gonna call them the new cats. The last, the last generation of cats that really got that money, money. That's how they got it. The internet. We would. We really wasn't up on the internet as a culture. So the money was still able to be made, you know what I'm saying? Just as a culture all around, the artists, the consumer, the, the, the record labels, you know what I'm saying? Folks just wetting up on the internet all like that. So it enabled us to still be able to make that money. But once we really got our hands wrapped around the internet, we shot ourselves in the foot. Yeah, dang. Shot ourselves in the foot. Now, as a producer, it's awful. It's God awful. It's a sin and a shame. It makes no sense. Yeah. Literally. Yeah. Rick Ross put out a great mixtape for free that would have been an album that everybody would have had to pay for. And the producers would have got the publishing that they're supposed to get for the album being registered and everything, but that goes under the wash when it's a free mixtape that you give away. Yeah. It's a problem, man. It's the, the problem with us, man, we, we follow trends before we research. Once we see a certain amount of people doing it, we kind of just jump on web like, that's the thing to do, that's what everybody doing. I'm going to do it too, I'm going to do it too. Never stopping to think like, wait a minute, does this really make sense? Like, the exact, my main example that I use all the time is when the RIAA came down on drama and them, right? Right. Now, they came down on them for putting out mixtapes that consisted of artists rapping on other people's beats that were already out. Like, for instance, like, it's a, it's, I'm an artist. I just put out a mixtape. I'm rapping over 50 Cent's in the club. I'm rapping over, uh... Uh, Jay Z's one some song off the Blueprint. I'm mm -hmm. rapping on a bunch of instrumentals, and we're selling that. Okay, the RIAA come say, hold up, man, that's licensed material. You can't sell that, so they shut it down. So we go from selling a CD full of licensed beats to making albums and giving it away for free. Yeah, make it make sense. It yeah. makes none. It should have been the other way around. Keep doing. The, the, the mixtapes rapping over other dudes' beats, keep do, just don't sell it. Right. And then sell your album. Yeah. What are we doing? What are we really doing? Yeah, I guess you're right. Shooting, shooting yourself in the foot. With a Uzi. <laughs> right. Nothing to stand on. All right, man. We're going to uh, cut it off right there, man. You've been live in the studio, my man, El Timo. Yeah, man. Drop some logic, game. man. You know what yeah, I'm saying? man. Please wake some people up, man. It's not like you're right, man. Times and change. You ain't dropping knowledge. You're dropping logic. <laughs> yeah, man. Right. Own logic. What's up? Right. His own logic, too, man. Like, All man. right, man. We appreciate it, homie. Anything you want to shine? Any contact information? Anything you want to throw out there? Website? Uh, anything? Man, Twitter and Facebook and... All the other stuff or whatever, I guess, if it's anything else out there. It's all L T out there. L T M O E. And my closing words is all y'all is computer literate. That's why everything is the way it is now. So I don't see why it's so difficult to go and Google whoever you you passionate about. Put L T Mo's name in the search engine. Put Four Eyes name in the search engine. Put DJ Scorpio name in the search engine in your computer. <coughs> Hit enter and watch what happens. I promise you, a plethora of things will pop up. A multitude of things will appear in front of you. I'm screaming a cornucopia, if you will, of <laughs> items will appear in the screen available for you to witness, download, listen to, and enjoy. That's all I got to say. How do you spell L T Mo? Let's get this L T M O E. All right, that's the Twitter? Yep, Twitter and Facebook. LT space M O E. Yep. And f number four. I oh, it ain't no space on the uh, ain't no space on the Twitter though. It's just. Oh no, no, that's no space on Twitter. L T M O E. Yep. Right. All them Twitter <coughs> folks, they already know ain't no spaces on no Twitter. Yeah. As you gotta tell them, I'm staying mm -hmm. ghost on this one, so don't even try to find me. I'm just DJ Scorpio. If you wanna find me, you'll find me. Gone. Word.